Hey guys, Rashid Phillips here, and welcome to Smoke Sessions. I've teamed up with my great friends, The Home Depot, Kingsford, and Masterbuilt to bring you these amazing grilling techniques to help you master your flavor. Today, we're gonna to be braising, which is essentially heating techniques that allow you to break down and tenderize your meat. Today, we're actually gonna be using beef ribs. Let's fire up the grill and set it to 350 degrees. I've loaded in my Kingsford charcoal. As our grill comes up to temp, you can already start to smell that basil, sage, and thyme. Next, we're gonna brown our beef ribs while at the same time searing our veggies to release their natural sweetness. Now that our beef ribs are seared and browned, we're gonna place them in the pan and set them to the side. Next up, we're gonna start preparing our vegetables and herbs. Now we're gonna form our braising liquid, which is very simple. With our braising liquid and vegetables added, it's time to lower the temperature to 300 degrees. Next, we're gonna cover our beef ribs with aluminum foil, place it on the middle rack of our 1050, and cook for roughly four hours. It looks like our beef ribs are ready because it's starting to pull apart very easily from the bone. All right, guys, time for my favorite part. I get to try the labor of my hard work. <laughs> These beef ribs are extremely tender. The great aromatics and flavors from our herbs and garlic the kiss of smoke when we first charred the beef ribs, just getting those little edges. The basil sage and thyme from the Kingsford Signature Flavors really pops. Head on over to Home Depot and grab yourself a Gravity Series 1050 and a bag of Kingsford charcoal, and I'll see you guys next time.